What's up everybody, I am here with some more Tomb Raider. <laughs> uh, last time, uh, we finished uh, the main game. Uh, finally, we got Laura and uh, what's left of her crew out of here. So, but it's weird that we're back in the island, right? Well, of course we're going to be back in the island because this is an open world game and there's a lot more to do. And there is a lot more to do here in this game, so we're not actually finished. Here is a... Uh, a tomb. No, not a tomb. Um, collectible. A diary. But before we actually get started, uh, the first thing that we're going to do, or well, I'm going to do, uh, is uh, do the tombs first and then uh, find the, all the collectibles. I'm still thinking about that, but anyway, but over here, there is a tomb here. This is the DLC tomb I was talking about. I think I was talking about at the beginning of the game. Or uh, during the last video, that uh, there is a DLC tomb right here. There's a mine shaft here. This tomb is not recommended towards a hundred percent. It's just something there, you know, as an extra tomb to raid. But this is not part of the main game. If you do want to get a hundred percent, so don't worry about that. And that's if you uh, want to do the, uh, the the DLC tomb. So I'm not gonna do that because that's not recommended to the sense. I would I would like to show it, but uh, uh, that tomb is uh, that comes with uh, the DLC with comes with the tomb and extra multiplayer stuff, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. But I don't play the multiplayer here, so that actually there's no point for me to actually get it. But, well, the, the tomb that we're actually going to go to is the uh, mountain, mountain Village. There are two tombs, I try to say that five times, uh, to raid. So we're actually going to go there. Uh, is there a... I gotta go to the base camp. So I'll just cut away until I actually get to towards the tomb. Okay, so now we're here back... Well, now we're here towards the uh, Mountain Village. Uh, before I actually uh, go to the tomb, if you come back around here, um, you'll be able to find some salvage and stuff. Uh, the reason why I haven't, uh, I've, well, of course I've missed uh, some of the salvage is because, yeah, I don't, to be honest, like, I don't want to like waste a lot of time just finding salvage and, uh, and upgrading the guns, even though I'm just doing this. And if you uh, revisit uh, some of these areas, there'll be some uh, remaining uh, bandits, as you want to call them. But the reason why I haven't uh, want to collect all the salvage is because to me there's no point of upgrading everything, even though I'm just doing this as a uh, as a walkthrough just to show it. But to me, to me, there's actually no point. So the guys are He's up there, but yes. But if you come back uh, to these areas, uh, you'll be able to uh, encounter what's remaining of the bandits and stuff that's on this island. And right there's another collectible. Yeah. So if you come back, you'll be you'll be able to uh, to uh, come back and uh, search remaining areas that uh, you haven't uh, explored. Like finding uh, missing salvage and stuff. This asshole. Look at this guy. Got him, headshot. Yeah, see, that's the reasons why I haven't. Explored all these areas. Nice. 
Yeah, that's my reasoning why uh, I missed like a bunch of salvage throughout the game. It's because uh, I think that there's no point to actually getting those. Of uh, upgrading uh, the little weapons I have just to uh, do a walkthrough of it. To me! That's why I don't. That's why it's no point of, of doing that. What is the first? Did I miss the first tomb? Oh no, we gotta go up higher. I wish uh, there was a me map here. Here it is, right here. The nearby tomb, that's where I am. Of course, that's where, this is where I am. So now we're, gonna, well, now we're here at the first tomb. Ah, there's secrets. In here, there's secrets. Now, I will be d doing all the tombs in uh, one session. So, let's see if we can do this uh, quick. Because, like I said, there are a total of seven tombs. Uh, eight, if you count the uh, DLC uh, tomb in the uh, coastal village. And here is a camp. I believe there's no other salvage around here. Hmm. Gilded figures, servants of the Sun Queen. Tomb op optional tomb. Tomb of the unworthy. Uh what well, it looks like okay, so what you gotta do. Whoops. So now we're at the first tube, Tomb of the Unworthy. In order to get over there, uh, you have to burn uh, these uh, corpses. Now this is the first tomb. This tomb is actually uh, pretty simple. Hey, come on, what are you doing? Burn it. Stop burning. Okay, now we could. Okay, now we could jump to it here. This may have been built in honor of her priestesses. Incredible. <gasps> Tomb Raided. So when you raid a tomb, uh, you'll gain salvage. Relic found, relics found, and maps and found. Yeah. So each and also each time when you uh, raid a tomb, it's possible you'll be able to uh, unlock. See, look, we've unlocked um, all of the collectibles that's here throughout the island. As you can see, right there. Now, if I remember correctly, uh... Epic music. Upgrades, weapons, uh, and skills of the camp. Yes, of course. Yeah, well, I was gonna say, um...
Yeah, so as you uh, uh, lay tombs, uh, you will find, uh, you will unlock all the collectibles. Yeah, you'll be able to see the lo wall locations in the map. So that's so that's two choices you can do: either uh, raid tubes to uh, unlock uh, collectibles you can see on the map, or find the treasure maps, as you can see there. See, look, all all these uh, the, the collectibles all throughout here throughout this island. See, see, there's 15 GPS caches, all that stuff. I don't count 15 unless I have to unlock, find the, to find that treasure map. Okay, so that's the first tomb raided uh, in the mountain village. So now, uh, what I'm supposed to go now? I believe I'm supposed to head towards the other side. Yeah, I'm supposed to head towards the other side. Yeah, and over here you'll find the treasure map as you raid the tombs also, so you can unlock uh, more of the uh, of the uh, collectibles around here throughout this island. See, I was right. There are more because you only see only a little bit of the of the collectibles, not the whole thing. So yeah, I was right. Okay. So I'll just skip ahead until uh, I uh, head towards the next tomb. Okay. So now we're here uh, at the next tomb, which is uh, right over here. Oh, this place is huge. Okay, so now we're gonna head in towards over there. We're gonna head in towards the second two. Now, as you uh, raid uh, the tombs, uh, they do get a little bit more challenging because the puzzles are a little bit more difficult to uh, solve. I can't do that. Oh yeah, I was trying to pull all the. Uh, Okay, I got 1300 salvage. How long does this thing go? Now at the second tomb, Hall of Ascension. We're here at another day camp. But now there's skill to do, but I don't see the whole point of doing them. Uh, God. It's upgraded one. This one can be a little bit tricky, so what you gotta do is, you gotta bring this up, so you can climb towards that wall. But, in order to do that, I think, what you gotta do is... Oh, I think I know what I gotta do, okay. First, what you gotta do is, close this window, this right here. Wait for this window to uh, punch open. So I only have a little bit amount of time to actually do it. Oh no, it's not gonna do it. Yeah, I forgot. Whoops. Okay, so what you gotta do is first close this window, quickly run towards this level over here. Bring up. Yes. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Now you gotta wait. Ah, it's not working. Okay, why is it not doing that? Then you gotta break 
das einfach ab. Okay, now. Oh, yeah. I know that I got up there, you gotta time this just right. So, this is a little bit tricky to actually do. But it takes some time to actually time this right. I know that I do the survival instincts. Damn it! Why isn't that doing it correctly? That's the thing I don't really understand. Okay, that I know how to. Okay, close this. And I believe you gotta wait. Yeah, it's with that brings up. There you go, I got it. Okay, good. Yeah, so I had to time it uh, when pulling the, the other lever. Because I hate doing this, this tomb. This tomb's annoying because you gotta time it. So you gotta time uh, the uh, when the window uh, breaks open when pulling that lever. Part of a larger complex of ruins. So they go around here. Okay, that only took like like three or four tries. <gasps> Tomb raided. Hall of Ascension complete. One out of three shotgun points found. Yes. And, oh, and that's one thing I did forgot. GPS caches are not found in the location. The one thing I did forgot to mention also, as you also raid tombs, you will gain um, upgrades or parts for uh, for your weapons. That's one thing cool about it. So now, uh, let's get out of here. I got a lot of salvage I could do. Mostly these last salvages are like pretty expensive to upgrade. Excuse me. I'll do the last one. I don't have a, I don't have enough. Okay, I'll do that. I don't know why I'm upgrading these <laughs> these weapons. Even though this is just we finished throughout the, we finished through the whole game, but like I said, if you do want to get 100% uh, for for all the weapons and upgrades, then you can do it. But uh, I'm not gonna uh, put all that time for upgrading uh, these guns for these weapons because I'm just gonna because I'm one I'm doing a walkthrough of this so and I'm not gonna go back to it once I finished everything unless uh, I've uh, played the multiplayer but I don't play the multiplayer here in this game so there's no point but and also I uh, we found all the GPS caches here uh, in this game uh, see, that's what I was looking for. So there's all 15 uh, GPS caches, uh, seven documents you can find here, and uh, what else? Oh, relics. There's the relics, and that's it. And plus those two, the illumination and the egg, the egg poucher, 
Uh, those are the challenges, but I'm not gonna do those. Not, not, well, not yet. Ah, freedom, light. Okay, so now, uh, since we raided uh, these tombs, now it's on to the next one. Next one I'll do is the shanty town, which there are two tombs here. So I'm just gonna head towards over there. So I'm just going to uh, cut away until I actually get uh, get towards the shanty town. Okay, so now we're here in the shanty town. Fast travel. Uh, if you fast travel to one of the base camps, uh, you'd be in next to the tomb. So now we're gonna get more of these guys around here, but I'm not gonna bother. So I forgot which tomb is this one. And also, I forgot. I forgot, also forgot to mention. Uh, depending on the area, as you can see, there are two tombs here. Uh, if you raid both of them, you will unlock all of the uh, collectibles, and you will be able to see throughout the uh, out the uh, throughout the area, as I explained before. So you don't need to find the uh, you don't need to find the treasure map in order to see all the collectibles. You could just raid the tombs, and you'll be able to see all the collectibles. So, like I've said throughout the, the main game, it, it will be a lot more easier to actually find the collectibles. So, uh, in my opinion, I don't think that there is uh, no point to actually find the collectibles, to, uh, to do the collectibles. Even though, like, we'll, we'll be able to see them on the map. So. Like I said, if you raid the tombs, or find the treasure maps, you'll be able to find the collectibles. So it'll be less stress on you. Uh, for you if you want to get a hundred percent. And now I'm lost in a cave. Are we here? Shame of judgment. Some kind of workshop. The Solari have completely taken over the old places of this island. Oh, uh, the Solari. I don't know why I call them Oni. I think Oni is a different name for Solari. I don't know. So now we find another uh, day camp here. So now, what we gotta do is, as you can see, you see like these uh, gas containers here. So if you bring them over towards here, I believe. So you gotta reach towards this wall over here. Hmm. Those shells look weak. A bit more weight ought to bring them down. Okay, see so as you can see. You gotta reach a wall over here, and there is a you can say teeter totter right here. Okay, so we gotta find. Yes. Yeah, just leave it right there. Uh, where's the other one? Oh, the other one's over there. Uh, we can't break that. Ah, I see. Can we reach that? Okay, good. I think I got it. Nice. So 
we gotta get all these, uh, you could say gas canisters. I'm bringing them towards over here. Good. And now, there was enough leverage to reach towards these jagged rocks. Now, you don't need all four, you can just get all three and just uh, time quickly so you don't have to, like, uh, fall and not reach it. Let's see one of the easiest ones. <gasps> Too much judgment complete. A weapon modification is available. Two out of three shotgun points found. Nice. And the GPS catch is found uh, in the meter map. Nice. Oh yeah, we're inside that tomb over here. Okay, so now since we raided the Tomb of Judgment, uh, I'm just gonna cut ahead until we actually get towards the uh, to the next tomb. You are the light. You are the storm that rages at night. We are your children. Wait for the day. Bring us the dawn. Show us the way. Hey, look at these guys. Praising for the Sun Queen. So now we're here at the next tomb. Which is, she will rise again. Before I forget, the tomb is right over here. As you can see the GPS catches when we unlock, when we uh, completed the other tomb. And there's some more salvage here. Do I have to jump? Okay. Well of Tears, the next tomb we have to do. Statues of the Sun Queen. This was once a sacred place. Okay, this one's actually pretty simple. So now you gotta have all these canisters. And you gotta... This is timely. Lower them. Ouch. Uh, they can be discovered. Yes, we know that. And as you throw these uh, canisters up here, you will lower down the uh, elevator. That's right here. You could just. That's just we have the level all the way down. Now. Oh, great. So now you have all the way down. You gotta quickly run. God damn it. Okay, wait. Uh, I think I know what I was supposed to do. Just have whoops. Shoot up. Oh, I'm too low. Okay, now have this one up. There we go. Now, 
now the uh, level is gonna go all the way down. Does it go up? Oh, yes, it does. Okay, it goes up. We got it quickly. Nice. And jump. Okay, so I say you, you gotta time it. Cause then you gotta time that correctly. Tomb Raided, Wall of Tears. 